don't have any bad news for you. That is good news. All the good news I oh, have, very though. good. That is good news. Best news I've heard all day. <laughs> good. That'll be five copper. Oh, shoot. Tips. Oh, goodness. <laughs> oh, looks like my coin purse. I left it in my other... Really? One of the coin cousins that's, doesn't that's have okay. coin we on get it. You tomorrow. It only has 500% interest. Wait, where was your coin purse oh, okay. again? As yourself a merchant now. Sweet. Nothing, Kyla. No. Uh, <laughs> yeah, let me. name. <laughs> <laughs> what? Excuse me? <laughs> you have good news for me. Right. <clears throat> I have good news for you, Sharik. Um. Yes. I have a way to get you cheaper iron. Ooh. Okay. I worked out a deal with the Caravaneers Guild. It's not the cheapest iron, but it is a lot less expensive than what you are currently paying. I can get you ore at 10 coppers per. That's significantly better than bulk. Yeah, last time. That's now, here's the thing. Let's see. Kind we of could get you up to. Hoping it would be. When you said, hey, I've got a good deal. We can get you 20 of them. Uh, so what is that? It'll take two days. Two days? Okay. Yeah, uh... So 20 at 10, that is, uh, 200. That's two silvers, two silver. I believe. Uh, for double what right. you were charging us before. Yeah, sure. Great. Uh... Wonderful. Yeah. Uh, should I put an order in now, or... And you keep... <laughs> yes, put it in now. If you can pay now, that is, um, the most... That's the okay. best for us because we have to pay for a, a bunch of lump sum items. Order 20. Perfect timing, he says. Then he fucking just... runs away. Fuck you, dwarf. 20 iron ore. I don't see any that way around. Two silver in two days. I feel like you were dropped on your head and then fell down a set of stairs when you were young. Now, what's important is that you don't go spreading this around because I don't want to get anyone that's in the current iron trade angry at me. Spreading what around? Have to be here for me to be upset with him. <sighs> Good man. Hmm. Okay. Have that to you in two days. All right. Appreciate it. Hey, you're a good man. I'm trying. Well, how's your, um, is he, is he your father? Yeah. The man? Sure. Does he, okay, excellent. How is your father's arm? Uh, he was in a lot of pain last night, so I don't know. He might be miraculously better tomorrow, today. I haven't seen him yet. Hmm. Still resting it off, I'm guessing. Yeah. I'll give him my regards. And, um... Uh, if you need anything else, let me know, because we can pick up other things. Oh, yeah. Do you have anything specifically you need? What sort of things? Yes, we can get you, um... Well, any kind of metal ore and coal. And gemstones if you need them for whatever reason. All sorts of things. Hmm. And anything else, you know, honey, whatever. Interesting. I'm sure Ladia will love you if uh, you can supply her honey. Oh, yes, we've already talked to her. But um, we can get you copper, tin, lead, silver, <laughs> gold if you were able to afford it. Wait, silver? Silver ore, yes. For whatever good that is. You understand what silver... What? I'm thinking something else. Yeah, never mind. Oh, it's expensive. Yeah, that would be fucking... Yeah. Hmm. No, I'm having bad thoughts about how to break the economy. I shouldn't do that. Very good. Thank you, Vezrin. <laughs> <laughs> right. Take care, Sharik. I'll see you. Of course. I had a question for you. Doesn't have to be fulfilled right now. Just gauging prices right now. Mm. In the future, iron ore, 
how much would it cost for a dagger to be made? For an iron dagger to be made. Uh, yes. That would be around two silver fifty, depending on what sort of prices we're looking at for the iron for that day. Okay. Might be, probably be a little less, might be a little more, around two silver fifty. Yeah, and you also need to find someone who can teach me how to use a dagger, but that's something else entirely. Mm. <clears throat> Hey, holding up, Sif. I probably should have told him. He's looking for someone to teach him how to use a dagger. I don't know how to use a dagger. Uh, you should have told him. I know I should have told him. But I'm holding up fine, just uh, waiting on the dwarves again. Oh, <sighs> yeah. What a fun. What a... You guys gonna fight or something? I don't know, the fucking Longbeard wants to talk to me. Uh, did you check his study? I don't even know where that is. Okay, let's go have a look. See if I can speed this process up for you a little. I mean, I don't give a shit either way. What are they going to do? March eight of them out there again? <laughs> All right. Let me see if he's in. More in. Ah, there you are. Uh, oh, Sif is down here. She said you were wanting to talk to her. I seems that some of the dwarves while I went away decided to get themselves into a bit of trouble. Yeah, I heard about that. Found him. Just a moment before we begin to talk, you have an axe blade in your neck. Oh no. Oh. I shouldn't have that there, that should be right there. Did that fix it? Yes, that fixed it. You're a little was in your neck for a moment there, I was very concerned. Loty Morden. How good yes. you found each other. So, I take it you're the one that was what? wronged what? by the local Dawe, yes? That really short hair, it's really prickly. Yes. And a quaint way of putting that. A quaint way of me to hear it as well. <clears throat> <sighs> I hope that goes okay. I'm on word for the Dowie. Because they're claiming things and the Dowie might be claiming something else. I don't know. No, he's... Who's telling the truth right now? Handling it, apparently. Apparently, he's, he said that his... Uh, Dawei got into a bit of trouble and he's gonna fix it, so... Yep. Bit From the sound of it, basically, Sif and them messed up. And, uh... Some people lost their hands. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's that's pretty bad. So yeah, hopefully they'll be able to figure it out so that uh, a bunch of Dowie don't kill themselves. No. So, because uh, I'll tell you this, um, uh, they might be able to kill Sif, but they're not going to get out of that unscathed. Oh, God. Yeah, it's getting to that point. Hopefully, uh, Morty can calm them down. Yeah, hopefully. Oh, where was that? Uh, do you know where that? Uh, I think it was an Imperial, the one with the fluffy looking hat that was yellow. Uh, God, I haven't seen them in a while. Oh, I hope I could spot him. He, he may have me make this trinket for him. You know, I don't entirely know where the stone cutter is. Excuse me, oh. do you all know where this stone cutter place is? Oh, it's right over here. Okay. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. But I didn't Dredge, good to see you. Good to see you. Easily use you. Would be. Of course. Um, well. Uh, Aldo told me to apparently see you since you're the one. He said you were the one rounding up everyone. Mr. Tane. Break Mox's ass again, or he pay you your money? He paid it back, and I didn't break it the first time. No, no, you said you just you just break it again to hit it. Yes. I was a bit short on coin. I still am. I don't really care too much about the money. It's just it's just ah, to I see. Of course. How you doing? If you looked around How are you doing? Will you let me help? Uh, you I asked help? first. No, I asked first. No. <laughs> Fine. I'm doing okay. I just wanted to check in with you. I've been poking around very much. I just need to get to work. Hmm. Would you mind if I gave you an inquiry on something? Of course. All right. There's a whole uh, platoon looking of elves in front with a dignitary from Eshmathalos. Oh boy. Good. Oh god, you're not gonna try and do the same exact thing as you did last time, are you? No. No? Alright, good. Just making sure. Okay, because I'm gonna move the anvil, like, in there. Hold up any of your what? <laughs> what is wrong with you? <laughs> Why would you move an anvil into a... What is essentially an olive oil? I will tell you the... Oh, it's good you're here. Yes, well, it's... I am very curious what you're trying to do to my word, Michael. You missed it. There's a whole procession of elves with large blades. Did Vezrin talk to you? Yeah. Good. Yeah. You're going to make that order? Yeah. Excellent. Yeah. Much better than the last price. Yeah. We did some digging. Good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everyone's happy for it. What's, take a days, what's the deal with hey, all that? There was just a lot of elves. Huh. Looks like there was a dignitary that showed up from Mesh with Loss. I hope that means good things for us. Um, maybe. We'll see. Hmm. Anyone at the fight pits, or is it quiet? No, I don't think there's anybody over there. Hmm. What was that about? You think I know? I was told a contingent of, uh, a large contingent of, uh, elves from, I think, the border came through and they were wishing to speak to the Baron. That's all I was told. 
Which is never really a good sign when it's that fucking many. Hmm. You could, uh... Can we talk? Sure. Let's go for a walk. See you later. Yeah. That just makes you feel better. Your advice. That's all I've done. Wait, no. Anyway, There's one sorry. of those. Uh, uh, You're a very cynical person. I have no idea you were talking about baby fat, but that's something else. Fight him for it. He Fight. told you big headed. I'm not Fight fighting anybody. I didn't say it. I, I'm just saying You're the physical descriptors of what changes between a child and a hobbit. I don't know. He looks a lot like Jerome. <laughs> Human brat. Did you know Lottie is really good at digging holes for herself? Crazy. And Couch was a Maybe minor. Are you? <laughs> don't you have some money to go? Riz up or something. <laughs> Go. Do oh, something with, with your life. With you and I just had this, a um, shiver down my spine. Seamstress. What is riz it with me? you two and using the word riz? I don't know what that means. Sure. It's Karim. Not even an Elvish Ma. term. Ah, I see. What the kids say. <laughs> I hear it all the time in school. Uh, well, I'm too old to understand what the kids say. Might has a guess as to what this is about. Uh, no. What do you think it's about? Oh, then no. Go ahead. What, what do you wanna? What? 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 Are, no. What did you think it was about? Now you got me worried. Is there something that I should be aware of? No. You're not gonna break my arms over the iron prices, are you? No. No. Oh. Okay, then we're good. Because if I'm able to come across them, I'm just going to charge you that much. Fair enough. That's how it works. Hello, Dolly. Right. You want to go inside? Uh, sure. It's actually business related, but if you need oh. to talk about something. No, no. I'm good to inside. I haven't actually seen your house. Oh. Come on in. So, uh, what's up? <laughs> he holds out a broken ass spike glass. I would like to get that fixed. Oh god, um, pff. this is more tinkery kind of stuff than I'm used to. I was going to help with it. Okay. I merely wanted to inquire if there was any kind of metal components that need to be used to repair it, not to mention Raylan would need to restain the quartz lens. I was gonna say these lenses is more Raylan's thing. What is it made out of? Iron? From what I know. Iron or brass. Hmm. Uh, well, if it's iron, we could, uh... We could definitely work on it, but... This is very delicate stuff. <sighs> I might be able... I haven't done any tinkering for a while. You already know that I learned that it fails. Right. I know how to fit the lenses into the framework itself, but the framework is, from what I understand, more of a blacksmith thing. Yeah, this so. is definitely some sort of uh, precision item. Let me, uh... <laughs> I <haven't> asked <laughs> about this. 
I'm just trying to give myself something to do. Hey, Giga, uh, I've got sure a question for you. I can always just go around all the I may have an answer. Go ahead. Um, Tang has handed me his broken spyglass, um, and he's uh -huh. asked if we could uh, work on repairing it. I feel like this is definitely a specialty item, and I feel like it's more tinkery than what Kyla would be used yeah, to. Yeah, ask, ask Bruns about that. That might be an engineer sort of repair. I'm not too sure. Yep. Okay. Yeah, when I see him, yeah. I'll ask him then. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Gigo. No problem, dude. Yeah, this is outside my wheelhouse. I should ask uh, Tazim when we see him again. He might be able to put a bit more light on. And honestly, if I'm going to work on something like this, I'd want him here anyway. But we can put it on his scope. You see. Just thought that I would ask. Figure out what might need to be done. Sure. Hey, have you seen... Have you heard or seen anything weird is that the elven entourage no not really okay just gathering rumors is that what I think it's about what do you think it's about the thing that's hunting in the woods yeah I know who it is. I know what's responsible for it. I'm trying to figure out who she's after. And who exactly is having these moments. Who wouldn't she be after? Well, if you haven't seen her, then... I haven't seen her. But on the way back from Kolkatis, something was following us. Right. By the way, have you heard anything about an iron wolf? Uh, no. In Gradia? Not an emergency of deal with either. No. Because apparently there is a legend about the iron wolf. I mean... Not me. Not you. Much before me. Wait, it wasn't, um... Apparently it's a pirate captain somewhere on the sea hoarding iron. Oh, what? Fuck. Uh, the fat dude. Cornwall. Wasn't, wasn't that his whole thing? He was the Iron Wolf, but I want to make sure that I'm not confusing the two. Uh, who else could it be? He did some swashbuckling piratey stuff know. back in the day, from what I heard when he first showed up. And he called himself the Iron Wolf, and now you're hearing about an Iron Wolf hoarding iron on the on the water. I mean, I feel like... Right? Well, I guess that's him. And if he was considered a pirate, then... That might be why I haven't seen any word or head of him in, since I've been in Gradia. Pirates are all over Gradia, Tang. Especially in Blackrock, they use that as a dock. It's pretty much ran by criminals over there. He probably just doesn't have a reason to come to Nortis at all. I mean, it is a pretty backwater town right now. I'm aware. It's cut off from every other dynasty. Exactly. All the other ones are trying to run it off the map. Yeah. At least for now. Hmm. All I really know about what's going on is what I've learned on the docks or what I've learned in the past couple of days. 
Well, which people on the ships aren't exactly chatty with somebody who only moves their luggage. Yeah, I feel like a lot of pieces are moving and we're only getting the tail end of a lot of them. So, we'll just have to keep our eyes open and see what's happening. Well, if you overhear about something going on with the Otis dynasty or Luxor in particular, please let me know. Sure. I don't want anybody starting wars with them. For clarification, my family lives there. Your family? So I preferred if they didn't end up under... Yes. I didn't realize. I'm sorry. They left Arland, came to Gradia much before everyone else and before everything else happened. When they got here, they actually ended up under servitude to, to uh, the Angel of Luxor. Hmm. Wife of the Dynasty Lord. The only conflict so... between houses that I see on the horizon of, between the Vapex and the Radods right now. I do have people listening out for anything between mercenaries, but as it stands, as far as I know, they should be okay. At least on the big scale. Good. I would prefer after two years of living just fine, I would prefer not to see my sister killed. She's all yours. Does the DM know? I'm, have some, I'm... Uh... I'm trying not to pretend that I recognize you, but I don't know if I do, so we're going to say I don't. Of course you do. I only hide from the people that don't need to know me. Move, invisible cat. Excellent. Move. Move. Well, it's really good to see you, Sarah. Move. You There's as well. no cat Thank there. You. Crazy bitch. Yes, there bitch. is. Listen, I haven't taken my fucking oh, medicine. Oh, just need the, the strong line. arms I needed. Oh, I, I... The Warforged Sorry, picks up the You need to come with me. I... No, he needs payment. <laughs> Really this need... is your charcoal. I really need to talk to Tizim. Well, he's yeah. talking to Sarah. He's I don't want to miss my chance. He shows up and disappears so quickly. Go ahead and talk to him. I'll wait. Thank you. Nothing, Tang. I love you. Kiss it. Tang. Good to see you. Ow, oh, pain. Good to see you too. I was pointing at your arm. Good to see it's, you know. I'll show you how well it's working. No, please don't. So it's Ashma for law. So it's the Empire sticking their cocks down our throats. I can never get a moment to just exist. Good news is. Interesting. Good news is, I'll be bringing in quite a lot of coin tonight. Ten silver to be exact. Five silver Tenth. will be going to the lot of you. Yes. How? Hopefully. Should I even ask? Your silence says it all. Then I won't. Just please just make sure whatever it is doesn't find its way back here. I don't think it could. I'm not really one to leave paper trails. Then I will trust your judgment. Nighttime isn't help. really my foray. So. Well, we love it, don't we? Yeah, I can actually look around without being blind. <laughs> we might be in the thick of it right now with ghosts, schools, and goblins, but. At least we won't be poor for much longer. I'm not saying I'm going to be bringing you... in ten silver every fucking time, but tonight's probably a... Good luck at those elves. Mm. I don't know what insignia they wear. If they had it, it was either under their cloaks, or the ones where it was exposed were just too far away. 
did Vestrin but... tell you why they're here? Because he knows why they're here. I have my assumptions. Oh, he knows. And I know he knows, because he was in the bathhouse last night with that Radad fuck. The youngest. The piss-off. Kovas. Yes, apparently he's a Eshmethalos. Dignitary. Not sympathizer, but yes. He likes them. He won't work with the Empire. While the other brother, uh, Abum something like Ahmed. that. Ahmed. Ahmed. Ahmed wants to work I... with the Empire while Rod while the other one the fuck I cannot remember their names. He wants to work with Eshmethalos. Towards what I goal I cannot remember. The Imperium any day. You say that. Well, you say that. But we're looking at a lesser of two evils right now. Well, on top of that, Morden because came back today. Not only Elves are in Arrowland. And I'm sorry. Say that again. Elves are in Arrowland. Do you want me to go get him? He should be in his study. He can give you the rundown. Elves are in Arrowland. Wasteland, I know. Why would they go back? What do you mean by that? As far as I know, that's all he said. Elves are in Arrowland, and he's lost contact with all of the holds that were in the Arrowland area. That's thanks to the rats. He assumes so, yeah. Below, even the Underdark. I remember all the way back in Ledford. Um, those postings that were up, Nicholas read them to me. That their long beards and all their holds were called to arms to deal with an invasion from the Murgadrod. Which means the provinces closest to Ireland would probably be empty of fighting men. That is what he said, yes. <sighs> if there's overspill, I didn't even think of that. Furthermore, once Vernfoldor closed up their borders and their doors, they haven't been patrolling the mountain passes, which means things could get over, if they were determined enough. Oh, not going not to put the cherry on there. top, but the drow are not safe while elves are in Nautis, especially Ashmethalos dignitaries. Look, they... I don't know what's gotten into the high elves. What am I saying? Yes, I do. The drow are in danger. That's all I'm able to say in confidence. Your son, just as much as myself and Torti, could be snatched up by these fuckers and dragged off back to Eshmethalos to be... succumbed to fate, I guess. It's not good in the Underdark right now, either. I told you that. Something's going on between the elves and the drow, and I... I think Vestrin knows more, he's just not saying it. Also, what is this nonsense of an explosion I'm hearing taking the east? <coughs> and that it's Mirandel's fault? That it's Iandel's fault? Please tell me Cade's a fucking idiot and he doesn't know what he's talking about. Please? Tell me he's mistaken? He's not mistaken. So you're telling me all those people died? They were pressured by Fulgrith. He threatened to kill them all if they did not comply. And how did she even wind up in that situation, I wonder? I don't know. I'm sorry, Playing to his know. ear. She should have fucking listened to me when I got away from that. He's not our friend. No one is. I never thought of him as our friend. The only people yeah, that I did. trust are the people that have survived with us since the beginning of everything falling apart. Well, then what? Where the fuck is Ian, though? If Vestrin's here, where is she? 
You said she split off. Yet I see we wood seen elves her. roaming around around. For several years. There's potions going about. I can't is it the alchemist? What about that? I don't know. That that L woman she My knows Jensen. gut tells me that if there's potions about and it's not the alchemist, then perhaps there's someone else supplying them. Fiendel is within even a day's travel. I need to speak to her. There's if more here would know, than just. It would be Vezrin. Fuck Vezrin. Fuck him. I don't understand why you haven't beaten the shit out of him yet. We'd all be dead if it wasn't for him. I thought I'd never hear We that. were trapped in the same place that we were trapped when we tried to escape Ludford. We could not find the entrance to the deep roads. We had to fall back into the cathedral. And it wasn't just the rats. Rats and shrooms both attacking each other and us. We were being overwhelmed. How? Did you find a cave or something? He used the archway. He couldn't have. We took the tablet. I took that fucking tablet with me. So unless he got another he did it one. Without something. And that abominable writing that was on his arm has spread across his body. What? I don't know what it cost him. But to get us all out of there alive, he somehow used the archway. Every one of us that went to Ledford would have been dead. They were already away. I don't know what to do at this point. Just keep your fucking head down, Kyla. Oh God. My concern is the amount of involvement that is being made in the markets by some of our friends working with the barons. If they aren't careful, it's going to highlight the shit out of us. I was gonna bring that up with you, actually. What? I was gonna raise objection of Vezrin taking on both of these brothers at the same time. It just seems like a recipe for disaster. He shouldn't be Wait. dealing with anything. <clears throat> a noble before everything else. I have a bit of faith in him. It's... He's also overcharging everyone. For everything. On that Why? note, yes. well, he's managed to cut our supply down by half. Well, cost of it, at least. So. That's something. I don't know what he's doing money-wise. I mean, it's not my business. But if he does not be careful, he's going to attract the attention of the Merchant's Guild, of one of the Barons, perhaps even the Baroness, I don't know. Well, he's already been talking to uh, a Mem. He's already had face-to-faces with a Mem, and he was in the bathhouse yesterday talking to uh, Kovas as well. If they are all in the same room together, it's going to look like he's conspiring, not to mention the Imperials. I just, it puts my hair on end. What is his fucking goal here? You let me worry I know what he was speaking about with Kobaz. Speaking about money. How much money something was. I'm trying to remember exactly something about 366 silver for a week's pay. 
of something. Something having to Sounds do with like the elves. Mass contract. Maybe to the Sordillo company, yes. like I was talking about. Kyla, I know the bathhouse is your territory right now, but I could make use of it. They think I'm a worker there now. I could get close to this Kobaz fuck. And I'm not let Vestrin fuck this up. Conflicted on it because the whole reason I'm doing what I'm doing, the way I'm doing it, is so that it can't reflect back on you or me or him or Vezrin. But you being there is an asset. But I have assets there already. I'm conflicted about it. That woman is not to be trusted. Don't be stupid. She knew where I was. She didn't call you How out. How many fucking people? Yes, she did. How many fucking people, Kyla? Know where I am when I'm hiding. The answer is zero. Look through my records. I think I've thought of something I don't know yet. I'll be back in a bit. You need to be careful around people like that. I know. I know you know, but I feel better telling you because. Because Devil. I'm on top of it. I'll be seeing myself out. How bad is it? How bad is it? How bad is what? I take it you shared all the information we learned from Margrim and them. I tried. <laughs> does he even does he at least know about her? You know who I mean. Is that? Yes. Yes. I take it, did you, were you made aware of what happened outside the gates? Bunch of elves running about now. An entire contingent. Yeah. So... <sighs> this doesn't bode well. This only um, this only makes the situation with the elves even worse. There's at least. At least there at least 20, uh, 20 guards around the, around the envoy or whatever they were. I can imagine it was a dignitary or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Apparently they're on the hunt for drow as well, so I need to keep my head low. What? Just something Sarah was saying. She's a little worried about the drow in this city. Drow and the elves have been at odds for a while now, and it's been pretty brutal over there. There's a non-zero chance that they might, I don't know, try something. Let it go through me, or they're gonna try anything to get to you. Yeah. I see why she's so concerned now. That's cause make me even more, even me more concerned as well. 
Just gotta keep our heads low, like we have been doing. Did she say why they have to drown? Nothing specific. All I know is that the drow and the elves in that sort of area have been fighting, actively fighting a war for a while. So there's nothing to say that a huge group of elves being in here and seeing drow might, I don't know, make assumptions or want to ask questions or something. I don't... It's just a be careful kind of thing, right? There's nothing saying that they're gonna hunt me down and fucking kidnap me or anything, but it's just a sort of... Another thing we have to worry about, that's all. I would say I, I, it'd be a, fair, a safe assessment to make sure that you at least you're not... If you see any elves that are affiliated to them, uh, don't be alone or vulnerable in that case. Yeah, I'll keep my head down. Especially with increasing, especially increasing talks with Ashma. What, uh, what is Ashma? What is the game? <laughs> I gotta go find Alan. I have to help her with some stuff. We stay safe, okay? I was hoping to pick something up there. Oh, we can walk along then if you want. Yeah. How much do you sell that for nowadays? My hero and Sorry. my other hero. It's good Sorry. to see you. <laughs> yeah. It's it's okay, yeah. Shriek. I know you've been working your tail off. Here, let me go ahead and bring you in. All right. Charcoal is right here. Just the one unit because I gave you one yep. early. Thank you. Uh, think... Happy to make more for you tonight. I also have some more news for you. If you need some cold coke, I might be making some tonight. That might be handy. I'll so, if that ever by. comes up, mm. let me know. Thank you. I think you okay. do have business. Now I'm gonna completely follow you two back to your place once I'm done talking to Isabella. That dwarf thing shake out okay? Actually significantly better than I thought it would. Good. But now I have more questions than answers. That's usually how it goes around these fucking parts. I need to speak with the forge master should he come outside at some point today. Yeah, he was in for like a moment. I tried to talk with him and he disappeared again. It's kind of... A habit, unfortunately. He's a very busy person, you see. But I'll let him know. Thank you. Move.
Man, you try and tell people things, huh? You try and do your fucking job. <laughs> Have to process fucking It's a shame. I like the sneaky stuff, but it's frustrating. It's frustrating. Yeah, I mean, like, <laughs> I'm trying to do my thing, but it just... Not happening. Either like, oh god, crunchy. Either like, I try and give them information. And it gets glossed over or flat out ignored. Or like, did you get other people jumping in on it? I don't know. I just let everyone figure it out themselves. Well, they're certainly handling it that way. Probably go to my fucking spot, shouldn't I, if I'm gonna be here. <clears throat> See if we can figure out a way to get some one to look into it. But yeah, I don't think you have to worry. You have enough to deal with. I have already. Call of Sounds there when I try to be. Eh, it doesn't matter. As soon as I fucking try and talk to him, we'll be pulled away anyway.
the fuck? You're looking mighty visible, Mr. DM. Do I handle this? <sighs> Serveth is a loose cannon. <sighs> Fuck it all. That is a fucking jump and a half. Shut up, bird. You have no idea what it do be like. Care to enlighten me? Well... I've had alcohol, but not enough to get drunk. All of my friends are in danger. There's nothing I can do about it. I feel ashamed about the only way I can make money. You feel ashamed. And... Uh, what, peddling... Just has that effect, I don't know. Peddling drugs. Unrefined drugs, but yes, drugs still the same. How do you feel about it? Thought I should ask you. <laughs> before I continue. Service. <sighs> I've had different uh, experiences with that sort of thing. You don't want my opinion. If you want to do this guilt free. Would it hurt you if I did? Continue. No, I just can't be a part of it myself. Wouldn't let you get close to it. Just the coin. No. And the connections. It is great. I might ask if there are other ways. That doesn't have to do with drugs. More comfortable with killing people at that point. Uh. I don't want you to give to have any other reason to be stressed. No, I understand. It is great idea. You need to do things to make money. A lot of it isn't quite legal. I'm going to make so much coin tonight. So much fucking coin. Good. If you're in need of anything, by the way, that you don't want necessarily done under your name, I can get things ordered through Markle or Marin. Hmm. Linens, spider silk. I miss my sword. That's my next bet. That, you 
You're going to have to figure out on your own with first room. Yeah, I, know. I don't deal with ore, nor can I carry it around in bulk. I just Too small. miss my sword and armor, that's all. I feel weird without them. Let's work on your armor first. Marin is not lacking in what she can make. I will inquire about her spider silk. See how much she has. Or where I can get some for her. Spider silk is uh, expensive. I'm happy with leather, to be honest. Yes, but settling is not something that I like to do. Especially to the people I care about. Now that I'm in a position to provide instead of take. Going to make the most of it. So you will get your leathers, but they might have something underneath them as well. You trust me to dress you? <laughs> I'll get you armor. I have uh, some notes about it, but... Sure. You can hand them over to me tonight. Of course. I'll get that started with Marin after she finishes my outfit. Switching up the color scheme, going for something lighter. <coughs> White cloak. <laughs> I know. It's for the daytime. You're serious. So I don't have a fucking heat stroke. Yes, dead. <laughs> wow. Look, a bunch of the Gradian women have told me that I stand out too much, and that's not what I'm trying to do here. Streets aren't as dingy as they were in Erdwick. Not as many shadows to hide in until the sun goes down. Mm. I fear we will always stand out just because of, you know, the whole purple thing. Especially now that there's elves in Nortis. More so than normal. Why I'm sitting up here. I know... I know you don't know anything about it. Because I haven't had proper time to gather that information and disseminate it to you, but... The High Elves are... Not our friends. The I drow. figured as much. We've had our history, but it's been riled up recently by something. Vassarin knows more, but we haven't had a chance to speak about it. Uh, last time I heard we'll there was the a straight-up war between the two of them. I heard that they were killing drow, but that is only rumor. I have no proof. But not take any risks then. It's not like they could do anything, or at least I thought they couldn't. But now that the Underdark is quite literally more of a hellscape than it's ever been, hopefully they just change their minds and leave the Drow alone. They have enough to deal with. <sighs> Tonight I will be giving Torty her first Drow lesson. You have already received this information. Moons ago. Mm. But I want you to be there to give off a good impression for her. I want her to know that we are close and she can rely on me. I'm not exactly a model for girl. <laughs> yes, you are. She's not. But we can change that. She's a filthy thing. Too loud, too boisterous, too clumsy. She needs to at least be educated of where her skin color comes from. I will sleep easier knowing that she... What the fuck is he doing over here? Smart choice. He doesn't even know that I'm here. Or that it's me. Hopefully I won't have to slit his throat again. Though if he keeps hanging around those Imperials, I can't see any other outcome. <sighs> yeah. It's a good thing he's useful. It's a good thing I didn't cut deep enough. Oh, I can only imagine where you'd all be without him. Mm -hmm. Saved my life many times. I should have been there. Under Redford, with the rest of you. 
I should have stayed in Edwick. Not even just to be a guilt tripper seeking sympathy. But I wasted my time in the Underdark when I went down there. There was nothing, just failure. I could have done so much more. Now it's just time to play catch up, I guess. Yeah, it's high inside. The things we saw down there, I... It's to belong to me. I know what it's like to be haunted. I feel you. You don't ever have to get over it. Fuck the people that say you do. But you do need to learn to live with it. The memories. The nightmares. Constantly looking over your shoulder, wondering when the next strike is coming. That is what it's to be a drow. It's to constantly fear for your life. Because everyone tries to take it from us. They think we're imperfect elves. They think we are diseased. Rats. I just wish they'd all fuck off. All of them I wish I could take you and talk to you down to the Underdark. They dug themselves out. We found Risa. We found Nicholas. There's one missing. No. I didn't see him. I checked everybody that was in that fucking city. Fuck. All of them that were burnt, and I hoped that they were him, but I didn't see him. I'm sure he'll show up just like the rest of them do. Are you ready for that? I'll do what I have if to. If it comes to that, will you be able to strike him down? I'll do what I have to do. I'll be there by your side. It has to be me. I know. I'd never rob that of you. I've already done enough to that poor boy. Enough for a lifetime. We all do things we must to protect the ones we love. Even if it hurts them. And with that, my alcohol has run out. So I'm gonna go figure out how to get oh, more. Need a hand? Oh, she's tangled in my wires and there's a fucking invisible cat right here. It's a loki boki baby. Oh. If you have any coin to buy me a drink, <laughs> I won't ask you that. I'll talk to you later.
Proceed. Yeah, kind of. It's a bit of a stump, I guess. It's like... Cool, I'm doing all sneaky stuff and I love it and that's it's really, really fun. But like, what's the point? <laughs> you know? don't think Kylo can really rely on anyone right now. You are a ballsy little cat, aren't you? Wonder what goes inside that little brain of yours. I guess we just keep doing what we're doing quietly and maybe don't even fucking tell anyone about it. Cause it seems kind of pointless. You ever just 
you know. Yep. 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 Kind of makes you think, huh? Nope. You ever think that we're just in like a big simulation? You know? Nope. Hmm. Me neither. Yep. Like, what if we were all just ones and zeros played by people? Like, being puppeted by mm. people? With, like, devices nope. on their hands and feet and heads. You know? And there's a whole other world out there. <laughs> 